horrifying case out of Elkhart County that details, they're going to make you feel like it has to be a movie, but unfortunately it's not. In this week's Michigan Unsolved, Christine Karsten tells us about the brutal homicide of Jessica Starr. And we do want to warn you, the details you're about to hear are very disturbing. On August 8, 2011, 26-year-old Jessica Starr was staying with a friend in the 28,000 block of Melody Lane in Elkhart. It was around 11.30 p.m. when she just got back to the home after possibly going to the grocery store. As she was unloading her car, she was approached by an unknown suspect and brutally attacked. Someone inside the home heard Jessica screaming and was able to call 911. It appears um, from the evidence um, and what was released already is that Jessica was attacked um, potentially with a piece of firewood that was there nearby. Uh, there was a struggle. It started near her car where she was at and then continued on over to a, a brushy area near the home. In addition to being beaten, Jessica was also stabbed. When officers arrived, it was too late. She was already dead. It almost appeared as if someone were laying in wait for her to get home, um, so much so that even a light bulb on the porch had been unscrewed. Investigators say this was not random. This was a very targeted attack. There are neighbors in that area. They were terrified after this, uh, terrified that there weren't answers. Um, and was it safe for them to go out into their little community? Here's the good news. Detectives say there is a person or persons of interest. Now the bad news, they just don't have enough to make an arrest. Jessica's family is sitting at 12 and a half years of not knowing who or why their loved one was brutally taken from them. We, ha we have to do more. We have to speak out and we have to do our part to make our community safer and bring those that do crimes like this to justice. If you have any information, you're asked to submit a tip to Michiana Crime Stoppers. Every single tip is 100% anonymous. And remember, if your anonymous tip leads to the solving of this case or an arrest, you're eligible for a $2,500 cash reward. And to watch Christine's full interview with Lieutenant Miller, just head to our website and click on this story.